Originally called Kantipur, meaning City of Glory, Kathmandu, the capital of Nepal, is a fascinating city with a rich history and culture. Kathmandu was never invaded by foreigners, something the Nepalese are proud to declare. It is home to seven UNESCO World Heritage Sites, one of which is the Kathmandu Durbar Square. Also known as Basan Tarpur Durbar, it never fails to impress first-time visitors with its intricate wood carvings and rich history. A variety of attractive handicrafts are also available for purchase in the courtyards. Step back in time and wander through a tapestry woven from centuries. Explore a realm of architectural wonders, majestic palaces, and vibrant marketplaces. This sprawling square hums with the enduring legacy of Nepalese heritage, where intricate Nuwari architecture and exquisite woodwork intertwine. Lose yourself in the labyrinthine alleys where sacred temples whisper tales of Hindu deities and ancient sculptures stand as silent storytellers of dynasties long past. Devotees seeking blessings present offerings to the resident deities. Respecting these practices unveils the deep-rooted beliefs that color Nepali traditions. The artistically adorned palaces and pagodas are equally captivating. Their historical significance interwoven with their architectural beauty. The pilgrims who can make a visit to the Swayambhuna temple can equally benefit by visiting miniature replica of it. The 13 steps on the spire stood of the stupa signifies the 13 stages to reach nirvana. Tamil's food stalls burst with an incredible range of local favorites ranging from savory to the vibrant, delightful selection of fresh tea leaves. These shops offer loose leaf teas, often organic and sourced from Nepal's Himalayan regions. Expect a range of flavors from black teas to blooming flower varieties. The maze-like streets are lined with shops and stalls, offering a vibrant atmosphere. Kathmandu reflects the country's rich tapestry of religions, offering spiritual teachings in monasteries, temples, and even some schools.